We're in Vegas. We came straight from the airport to Captain Six Seafood Korean Barbecue. We have the first round of orders, including a chef special. Yeah, I'm so excited, I'm so hungry. This is a chef special. I think it's tomahawk steak, galbi, and ribeye. So we got shrimp, we got mussels, we have the fried sushi, and we have squid right here. Conservatory of Flowers. Day one in Vegas, we got breakfast. We got savory crepes from Bellagio Patisserie. It was really nice walking through the entire Bellagio and we saw Christmas decorations. We're gonna spend the morning checking out different hotels. We're walking to the Cosmopolitan right now and we'll continue walking around the strip for the rest of the day. So let's show you our week in Vegas. We've been walking for like four miles. I'm pretty exhausted, so we're gonna go check out Caesar's Palace and get a drink. Promenade is our favorite. It's just more open, less smokers. It's more our vibes. Welcome to day two in Vegas. Today we're gonna explore the other side of the strip. We booked tickets for the Van Gogh exhibit later this afternoon and tonight. We'll be going to the Bacchanal Cafe. This is the main thing we're here for and most excited for. The ceilings are so nice in here. So far, this is the prettiest hotel we've seen. Everything just feels so classy and so fancy and it's so nice to walk around here. It's so trippy. Tuesdays. Also, the Van Gogh Museum was interesting, but I don't really get it. It's too immersive and too like modern art for me, but it was cool. I got some cool pics. Just checking to the Bacchanal, it was super easy. There's so much food, so pretty excited. A lot of lobster, a lot of lobster, a lot of seafood, and this scary looking shrimp. It's pretty ridiculous. They're so massive. They're delicious though. I feel like a savage just now. I just cracked probably like 10 lobsters. We had so much lobster and so much seafood, we definitely made it worth it. The Bacchanal though was kind of chaotic. There's a lot of people, the lines were all over the place. Overall, I would say it's definitely worth it. It's worth it just for the seafood itself. And you have an hour and a half limit, which is plenty of time. Day three in Vegas, we're pretty exhausted. We spent most of the day at the outlet mall, and now we're in Chinatown to get some jiggly pancake. We're at Sweet Honey Dessert. Right. Fresh cream and mango wrapped in a crepe. Mm. We got the strawberry souffle. It's actually jiggly pancake. Mm. Mm. It's so fluffy and it just smells in your mouth and the strawberry tastes so good on it. Tomato broth. First up is lamb. Ooh. Thick and juicy briskets. We finished eating chubby cattle and now I definitely feel like a chubby cattle. The oxtail tomato broth was pretty special, but it's nothing you must have. 
Good morning. Today is our last day in Vegas, and honestly, I'm pretty excited to go back. We've been doing a lot of walking, so my feet are tired, and it's so dry here. My hands, my face, everything is cracking. Overall, it's been a good trip. Definitely ate way more than I probably should have ate. I will see you back in San Francisco next week. Bye.